Hi everyone, my name is Erez and this is my first video blog, <clears throat> hopefully out of a series of a uh, few to come. I decided to start this blog on this uh, quite symbolic day. I just turned 40 and I am very lucky and fortunate and grateful to actually be here and speak with you because two years ago I was involved in a near-fatal car accident I hit a fully loaded 18-wheeler semi-truck head-on and almost died. I suffered multiple injuries, um, broken bones, punctured lungs, liver, sternum, ribs, the whole thing kind of crashed on me. Um, uh, and I had a 50-50 chance in ICU to actually survive through the first three days, which luckily, here I am, so I made it. And uh, throughout the last two years, I struggled with healing from all these injuries. And this has been a tremendous journey, a journey of growth, of dealing with pain, experimenting, and doing all sorts of things to be able to move forward with life. So the biggest challenge I am dealing with these days is my right leg. I shattered my femur in 17 places uh, and my ankle. During surgery, right after the accident, three out of four surgeons recommended amputation above the knee. And one surgeon actually said, let's put it together. He's a young guy. We'll try and see if he will heal. And I am grateful for that doctor for saving my leg. But unfortunately, it's everything above the knee which has healed. My ankle never did. I suffer from a condition called a vascular necrosis, meaning the bone in the ankle is dead, including... Uh, severe damage, nerve damage, and artery damage, which basically left me disabled. Um, I'm unable to walk properly, suffer from intense pain, and a very, very disabled lifestyle, which has, unfortunately, no medical solution to it. So throughout my journey um, and my research, I found that the only way for me to move forward in life is with an elective amputation. And my decision was made a couple of months ago, and I'm in the process of actually doing that, if everything goes well, within three months. And this series of uh, blogs is basically my way to document the process, share it with others, and provide some sort of a platform to have other people um, join in if they are in similar conditions or have questions. And I hope this will be of value to some of you. And I'll see you on the other one, the next one. So I hope you'll enjoy it. Thanks you for thank you for watching and see you soon. Bye.